Our next presentation is from Gina Vanacore with Reimbursity. Uh, they're another first time exhibitor here at Hinman, so please welcome them. Good morning, everyone. How are we? Are we excited to be here, or is everyone starting to fall asleep yet? <laughs> Want to stand up and do a stretch? <laughs> We're going to talk about medical billing, and this is a very hot topic right now. So I want to introduce myself. My name is Gina Vanacor. I'm with Reimbursity. And at Reimbursity, we are truly the medical billing experts. We are the solution in your dental practice. How many of you in the room have tried billing medical insurance? Nobody? Come on. Any general dentists in the room? And nobody's tried billing medical insurance? Wow. You have. OK, good. Any periodontists in the room? One back. OK. So like I said, medical billing is one of the hottest topics right now. And currently, less than 10% of dentists are doing so. So I'm going to show you the advantages of billing medical. And I'm also going to talk to you about what Reimbursity can do for your practice. So our first slide here is really about the advantages on medical billing. Of course, we're going to increase the practice revenue. You're going to be able to collect your full fee. How many times do we hear in dental, the dental world, I've discounted the CT scan, I you know, wrote off the procedure. We hear it all the time. So by using medical billing in your practice, you're going to be able to collect your full fee. You're going to be able to stop discounting some of your most common procedures. You're also going to be able to complete your treatment plans faster with no limitations. Dental gives you two exams per year. Medical, there are no limits with medical. So you are able to bill for every time that patient is coming back in. You're going to be able to save the dental dollars. And general dentists love this, because we all know dental insurance hasn't changed in the last 50 years. And if anything, it's actually gotten worse before it's gotten better. So by using medical versus dental, you're able to save those dollars. It's going to give you the competitive advantage in your market. All of your, your patients, their friends and their family, are going to be flocking to your offices knowing that that procedure potentially was paid through the medical versus the dental. And overall, it's going to help you grow as a provider, using the oral cavity as a complete health indicator to what's going on in the body, really connecting the dots. We all know that a lot of diseases actually start in the mouth and they're connected to everything else going in the body. We have a doctor uh, in California who's billing with us, and he said overall he has become such a better provider now that he's billing medical, because it makes him think out of the dental box. So it's really interesting uh, you know, when, you, when you hear these stories from dentists that are, that are currently billing. So who can bill medical? And that's always a, a very big question that comes up. Any specialists that are currently doing these procedures are able to bill medical. So you can see your exams and your consultations, new, existing, detailed, comprehensive, kind of similar to dental, all of your exams and consultations. But unlike dental, when you're only getting two, with medical, it's unlimited. All of your imaging, CT scans, cone beams, panos, all of those are billable appliances, sleep apnea. How many of you in the room are doing any sleep apnea? Just one? OK. And I know that that's a hot topic right now, because a lot of times it's not getting reimbursed. With medical, there is that advantage to bill it through your patient's medical. Night guards, prosthesis, bruxism, surgery, bone grafting, tissue grafting, osseous surgery, an uh, sedation, anesthesia, extractions, Implants on occasion, it really depends on the provider and if there are any exclusions. So there are some exclusions. The medical companies are looking for any reason not to approve the claim. Now, what are the keys to the success of billing medical? This is the most important thing. 
We know that 90% of your patients walking through that door have some type of medical necessity or a medical condition. We have to find it and you have to document it as the provider. So whether it's periodontal disease, diabetes, hypertension, autoimmune disease, taking antidepressants, oral medications, the list goes on and on, it's endless. But you as the provider have to find it, okay? Creating the proper documentation is also a very, very important tool and piece to this daunting puzzle. Creating the documentation is gonna be the key between getting an acceptance on the claim or a denial. So, medical insurance requ requires more detailed documentation. You need to do your CPT codes. You need to have ICD-10, the diagnosis codes, and of course the LMNs, which are the letters of medical necessity. So completely different than dental, right? And then this is also doctor-driven. If the doctor is not behind billing medical, it's never gonna happen in the practice. The biggest challenge, the biggest obstacle that we see in the office is lazy staff, and I hate to say that because I know there's a lot of staff members here, so no offense. But really, honestly, that is the biggest obstacle. Has to be doctor-driven, okay? And ba back to the documentation, there are a lot of courses, there are a lot of webinars that you can do, and you can buy software that's gonna do your cross-coding from your decodes to your medical CPT codes, but honestly, that's half the battle, okay? Maybe 25%. So, at Reimbursity, we are the solution to medical billing. We are the experts. We were birthed out of a dental office in Atlanta, Georgia. Okay, we're gonna educate, equip, and enhance your practice. We will access that extra wallet on the table. That's what medical insurance is. You use it like an American Express or a care credit, and everybody nowadays has to have medical insurance. And the definition of medical insurance is it's gonna cover from the tip of your toes to the top of your head, okay? So no cross-coding or complicated software with our company. We are gonna handle everything from A to Z. No additional staff needed. That's a big one. Everybody always asks, how much time is this gonna take my girls in the office or my guys in the office? We're so limited, we're so bogged down, we're just a really busy office. Reimbursity is gonna take that off of you, okay? We're gonna handle it all. From your verifications to your authorizations, we have a clinical team on staff that's medically trained and dentally trained, and we're gonna be writing the supportive documentation on your behalf. Medical billing is not hard, honestly. It's just new. It's new for you. If you've never tried it, and again, according to the amount of hands that went up, I'm kind of shocked that not more people have actually tried it. It's really the difference between getting $300 for a bone graft compared to $3,000 for a bone graft because there are no limits. And again, you'd be billing out of network. Okay, so you are able to increase your fees. You are able to open up access for patients that may not otherwise be able to afford having that procedure done. So it's really a great service that you can offer to your patients. Um, we are offering some unbelievable incentives for Hinman attendees. Um, our booth number, and I'm gonna show a slide in a second, we're 539. We have our medical expert billing team at the booth to answer any questions. And I hope that you come over and, and really take advantage and ask some questions, because it is very daunting. And there is a lot of skepticism out there in this industry. But I am here to tell you, we have a doctor in a small town in Alabama, and I can't mention his name, he is averaging seventeen to $20,000 a month by accessing his patient's medical insurance. We're doing all of his claims. His office staff may spend four hours a week uploading the information that we need to reimbursity, and then we're taking it from there and really following through on the claims. Like I said, doing the verifications, the authorizations, having our clinical team write the documentation, and that's huge, okay? Nobody has time to do that. So we take a combination of the doctor's notes and a question, a health questionnaire that we give you for your patient. 
which is probably more comprehensive than the ones you're using now. And we, that's how we create the documentation, okay? Of course, it's your NPI, and we're very protective of that, so we need a signature and an approval from everyone that works with us. We've been in the business for over 10 years. We're a national company, and it's honestly, if you're not billing medical, you're missing that extra revenue in the practice and helping the patient. You're gonna see your referrals grow and your retention grow, and it's just a wonderful, wonderful um, way to, to really you know, increase your practice revenue. So booth 539, we're gonna give you free evaluation, practice evaluation to see if you qualify. It really depends on the procedures that you're doing. So I appreciate you all being here and listening to what I have to say, and I hope to see you at booth 539. Thank you.